Going to pick up one of his fish. We're good to go. Check that it. That filtration system is probably around $10,000. Dude, this is ridiculous. Bro. Holy moly. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. Nice hairdo tonight. What is going on, crows? Welcome back to another video here. Today I am with Nicholas. Nicholas. Nick, how are you, man? I haven't seen you in so long. What's up, brother? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm back with Nick. It's been like a month and a half since I've seen you. You're a YouTuber now, so now you're just like gone. You're off the face of this earth. No, I'm not gone off the face of this earth. Then where are you? I live in the backyard. Where do you live? I'm not telling you. <laughs> I live somewhere in the backyard. Can you pull your pants up, dude? It feels nice. The nice cold air. It's nice to let it... Yeah. <laughs> okay. We got the tank here, y'all. Look at this thing. This right here we used to have in the old guest room. Now it's going back in. I cannot wait. The reason why I am getting this tank all set up again is because I am actually going over across the state to Sarasota, over to my cousin Dominic's house, going to pick up one of his fish. I'm not gonna say what kind of fish it is. It's an amazing, amazing fish. Has a lot of personality, let's give you that hint. And it's gonna go in this tank right here. If you have any guesses for what kind of fish it is, drop it down in the comments down below, and if someone gets it right, maybe I'll reply to it, but I'll be looking at the comments. That's what this tank is for though. So we're gonna get it all set up tonight because we're leaving uh, sometime next week, but I got a lot of stuff on my schedule this week, so tonight's the only night and I got free. And you gotta let it cycle for a couple of days. Exactly, days, that too. So we're gonna get this in the room, then uh, I'll pick up the camera from there. Ow. <laughs> Right, it's right, just ready? too One, difficult. Two, and three. All right. There we go. Open the door. Maybe you should walk back. Huh? <laughs> Ow! Ow! That actually hurt really bad. No serious. Ow! Oh! Oh! The dog knocked Bailey. What the heck? Just like that. It's inside the room. I believe this tank is. What? What is that, 45 gallons? That's uh, 65, my friend. 60, 65, 45, I don't know how many Not gallons it is. 65 gallons. And it's now another tank for the room. We have this tank over here, too. Little quarry cats. All the clown loaches are all hidden in there. Watch, ready? If I just tap the glass, meow. Got an angelfish. You can see the crawfish under the rock there. They all make their own holes. But this tank right here is for a special fish. You ready, Nick? I'm ready. We're going to Walmart. We gotta pick up a few supplies for this and the only place open Right now is Walmart. It's 11.52 p.m. Mm-hmm, it's late. Oh, foggy, wow. We are here at Walmart and what I need tonight is uh, a filter, maybe a substrate, and no decor because it's a uh, flower horn. Don't need that. Uh, this kid's over. Bird. It's like taking care of a five-year-old inside a toy store. Right there, baby. Ba-bam. Get this, make sure no one's opened it because, you know, Sometimes in Walmart, you'll open that package when you get home and... How's she looking? Looking good. That's what we want right there. And two bags? Two bags. For the boys. <sighs> that time you get in the gym. Listen, look who's talking, SpongeBob arms. <laughs> I'm looking solid. We're rolling. Got the rocks, got the filter. Leaving Walmart, see you at home. Well, good morning, Caferos. I completely crashed, passed out, right there, mid-filming this video. Like, I literally got home, put the stuff down from Walmart, and fell asleep in this bed that's not even my room. So, let's just continue on this video into today. It is 11 o'clock in the morning right now. Got the filters, got the rocks. Let's get those into the tank, and then uh, we'll see what the next step is after that from there. Boom, just like that, all the rock is in the tank. It actually looks really good, check it out. Perfect amount, by the way. Two bags did the job. We're not getting fish for this thing for a little bit, so we're gonna put the water in, let it run. Next step, filter. These right here are probably the worst filters to buy for longevity, if that makes sense. These things break within like two months, so I'm just gonna put this on and probably go get like a better one. Put this open. Flip these little filter extensions on, so now you have a full 
thing. You'll see how long it is now, and that's because this tank is height, not width. Just like that. Got to unbag both of these. Now, slide both these suckers right back in where they were. Good to go. It's not a bad looking filter either. Kind of cool. I need to now go find a hose to go from outside into there because all my hoses are being ran to certain different things. Found the one I'm going to use right over there. All right. It's, uh, just makes it. Look at this thing. And out that door. And this is where the water is. And now as we slightly jog back to the room, we hope the hose isn't just flying around the room. It is not. It's filled up. We're good to go. Check it, it is completely filled. It looks great, it looks absolutely amazing. Reminds me of the old days when we used to have a flower horn in one of these. I need a cup. Grab the cup real quick. Scoops of the water. Put it into our filter. We need to do this for all these little hangover filters. It gets them that start up. There we go. There we go. Boom. Just like that. Chillin', get our top here, put that on there. Check that out. Got a filter going and a brand new tank that's been sitting in my garage for months going. Heck yeah, once again, drop a comment down below on what fish you think we're getting for this thing. I'm excited for this one. Oh yes, dude. Boom! How the heck did I get here? Whoa, what the <laughs> heck, is that Paul? Bro, yes just... sir, what's up man? What How are you Franklin? Heck? It's been a minute. Why are you in my backyard? Oh, I just have special powers. I actually came over to Franklin's to come see his yard. I have not seen it in months, dude. What has it been? Oh, like a, it's been like almost six months. Yeah, bro. six months probably. This looks absolutely insane. You first walk up, beautiful aquascape pond right there. Is there any fish in there? Um, actually, currently, no, there isn't. No, no, we just redid the whole pond. It looks uh, okay. Very beautiful. Mint. Over here, there's two giant pool ponds. You know what? Let me stop. Show Let's go take a look. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, my God. Goodness. Oh, it's a big baby. Dude, uh, you have a massive platinum red tail. Yeah. Look at that thing. That's cool. Look at this guy. Look at that. Hey. So sick. He's got all his fish hand trained. Okay, I just put a filter into my pool pond. Uh -huh. Not that big, but pretty dang big. There's two of them in there right now. Uh -huh. So it should be clear. By the time we film it again, next video we film in there, it should be pretty clear. Now, maybe not this clear because there's massive filters, but clear. Holy moly. I didn't even see these red tails. Yo, they're huge. Oh my goodness. Okay, there's four just massive red tails sitting right here. All right, Franklin. All right, bro. So I told you I'm gonna, you know, pick something big up. So yep. get ready. You ready? You gotta go very slow, but he's got some pretty. Oh cool. my gosh. Hey, big mama. That is nuts. So this one's trained right here to let me pick her up, but all the other ones are gonna like fall in. Go crazy. Come here. Oh my gosh. You're literally, oh, oh my see, see, all goodness. The, all the other red tails around her, like jumping on top of her, like they kind of like spook her up a little, but if she was just in here. How big is the biggest, how big is that biggest one uh, right there? Probably between 20 and 50 pounds. Almost. Dude, this is ridiculous, bro. You got plecos, koi fish, red tail catfish, large mouth bass in there, right there. Yeah, and the cool big thing is that those hybrids. all part of each other, actually. So they're all like one big fish family. They don't eat each other. We do have little arowanas over there. Yeah, like smaller. Look but how I small train, the silver arowana is over there. I my bass not to eat them, believe it or not. It's, it's, it's kind of weird. Got the platinum red tail. Anyway, bottom line is, this is absolutely beautiful. I love the tint in the water. Here she comes. Look at this. And she's trained. You could pick her up and she'll come right is back to you. Is that crazy? I gotta try this. <laughs> they don't know me. They're like, I don't know that when, kid. Whenever, whenever they're hungry, trust me, they're the most trained fish in the world, but I fed them this morning, so they're like, eh. I this don't know who nuts. you are. So how much, how much food do you go through oh, having oh. something like this? You mean five pounds of tilapia every other day? Yeah, I was gonna say it, because I go through enough 
I couldn't imagine this. My this beautiful. Crazy. This might this might be the best selection of fish anyone down in South Florida has. Oh, I don't know, but that that's hard to differ. <laughs> Rod's got some pretty cool stuff, man. Well, I don't. Should we count predatory fins? Yeah, that's not even like a YouTube. I mean, that's not like a on. person. That's like a business. That's a business. Yeah, he's got yeah. a business going on. Sorry, Rod. <laughs> Come on, you lose. I think, dude, you just give me dab up, bro. Respect. That mm. is. He's got probably the best. I can't lie. This this kills. And water quality. Look at that, bro. And water quality. <laughs> but let me see the filtration on this thing. Show us you it. You ready, man. bro? Yeah. Yep. It's actually really small. This is it right here. Yep. That that's all. That, that's all of it. Yep. <laughs> I'm kidding. That's a heater. <laughs> I was gonna say what? It's actually all under this, and it's like filled with like water right now. So I, I don't know if you really want to get wet all up in there. Oh my. Oh wow. Giant okay. Yeah. Filtration okay. System. That is definitely insane. Did it right. I love my fishies. <laughs> that is insane. That filtration system is probably around ten thousand dollars. That's crazy, man. Ten thousand dollar filtration. Mine's probably six hundred bucks. I also don't have this many fish, though. If you have this many fish in a pool pond, you might need to spend the ten G's. Yeah, you never know. What's over here? Oh, oh so this is like more like algae blooming type. Yeah. Stage. So the thing with it is, is that I just have like a very small um, UV light over on that backside. Yeah. I the koi fish like it. I do do water changes. Aquascape's coming. They're going to hook him up with the filtration for this pond over here. This has turtles in it, a bunch of koi fish, and he was just in Japan, and he actually got a bunch more koi fish. So that's where all those fish will go once they arrive. Yeah, so this is actually very, very, very high quality koi food. And one of the reasons why that pond is so mucky is because koi, you know, when you feed them correctly, they're actually supposed to eat six times a day to actually, you know, grow them how they're supposed to be in You're Japan. Guy, aren't you? Yeah, I actually flew to Japan and learned all this stuff. So. <laughs> Look at them all down there, though. There's a lot. How many are in there right now? Not that many, only like eight. Not hmm. Nothing. Interesting. Nothing. That is all I got for you, Caparos, today. Thank you so much for watching. We got a new fish tank. Once again, comment down below if you think you know what kind of fish we're getting for here in the future. We came over to Franklin's house, raw fishing. Check this beautiful backyard out. He's got a ton of stuff going on. I'll leave his channel down in the description down below. If you want to see me film some more videos back here, let me know. Today's probably come a shout out because that to Andre. I believe is how you pronounce it. Love your videos. Thank you for being so inspiring. Proud. If you want to win a positive comment shout out and have your comment on the screen in one of these upcoming videos, all you got to do is drop a positive comment down in the comments down below. Make sure you hit that subscribe button for me, fellas. And uh, until next time, I'll see you in that next video. Peace. Pull your pants up. I'm going to get demonetized.